Much of what I am about to tell you is not well known. My ward, Johnny, was there ten years ago. She saw it with her own eyes. What you will already know is that Fremark was one of the great cities of Bastion. Ancient, proud, prosperous. But most important, it held the largest and greatest enclave of freelancers anywhere. The freelancers, along with the Sentinels, guardians of the walls, protected Freemark and its people from the chaos of our world. Until one day, the Dominion arrived on their doorstep. Cruel conquerors from the north. The Dominion, the Sentinels, and the Freelancers would make their claim for Fremont that day. Each group heirs in their own right to the legendary General Tarsus and her Legion of Dawn. One of our best, Freelancer Adams, led the charge as the Enclave leapt to meet the Dominion forces head on. My Johnny, says the army, was massive. The Dominion was led by Dr. Harkin, a man never seen before or after that day. He came to take the city at any cost. So they fought, outnumbered, outflanked, and outgunned. Three Lancers fought. They did well for a time. But the walls of the Great Free Mark did not hold. The Dominion poured in. Adams, with many freelancers, made their last stand outside the city walls. <coughs> While some, like Johnny, stayed to help who she could. When, without warning, the doomed sentinels fell back. But now I tell you that deep in the city, Johnny discovered what the Sentinels already knew. The Dominion didn't want to destroy Freemark. They wanted to capture an ancient Shaper relic that was protected deep inside the city. The Cenotaph. It seems this Dr. Harkin believed he had created a way for the Dominion to use the Cenotaph to control the Anthem of Creation itself. Arrogance. The Anthem will not be controlled. The terrible cataclysm which was Unleashed that day, destroyed Freemark, destroyed the Dominion, destroyed everything. 